would you encourage other people to read and write? Okay, that's a very nice question to ask. So I would encourage all of you. Basically, the youth generation in today's world are like really addicted to phones and internet, social media. Nobody ever really appreciate books as such. But if you listen to my story, I started at the age of 13. I started reading books, and I'm 15 currently. So I may be the youngest here, but I'm still proud of my poems that I write. Big round of applause and Thank you. So to start writing, you should firstly open some book and start reading. Whatever it is. It can be a picture book, of course, and it can be a novel, anything. But you need to start reading. I started reading newspapers at first, at the Times of India. So it really enhanced my vocabulary and my uh, literature also. The style of writing then in, the, in the newspaper inspired me as such. It's a really random way to say this, but yes, it did inspire me. So I started writing poems in the lockdown period, COVID, and as everybody said, COVID really inspired us. And I used to write these poems, like small, small poems every day. And those poems turned into big poems. And these poems are now in this book. And now if you give me a minute, I would like to recite a poem which is really close to my heart. Of course, go ahead. And in the spree of this women empowerment, this poem would relate to all of us. The poem is named as The Mirages of the Women. To all the women, I must. She's a devil by all standards. She's an angel in every situation. A personality no one can figure out. Mute as a dove, harmless as a dew. Cruel like anything, cunning like a fox. Yet she is straight, decide, and kind. She is crooked, cruel, and blunt. A person in whom everybody is interested. She'll run at the sight of smaller things than her, yet she'll challenge something bigger than her. Such a creation it is to see. She cries at every step, but she smiles at the hardest. It's confusing. She'll say she's this. You'll find out she's that. And yet she hates, she loves, she kills, and she saves. She's unbearably made, and she's greatly virtuous. Thank you. Very nice to you. Yes, you know. What about